Question one. Let's have a look at a question where we have to apply the properties of the quadrilaterals that we have learnt so far. Nola is thinking of a quadrilateral and provides the following clue to Alex: Its diagonals cut perpendicularly, but not all the sides of the shape are equal in length. Help Alex by writing down the special name of the shape. Well, we know of a few quadrilaterals where the diagonals intersect each other at ninety degrees. We know that in a rhombus, the diagonals intersect perpendicularly. In a square, the diagonals also intersect perpendicularly, and in a kite. The additional clue here is that they say that not all the sides of the shape are equal in length. Now remember that a rhombus and a square are special types of parallelogram, and in both the rhombus and the square, your adjacent sides are equal to each other, which means all sides in the shape are equal to each other. So, if Nola is looking for a shape where the diagonals intersect at ninety degrees and not all sides are equal to each other. Then obviously she must be thinking about a kite.